This is Dabu7. For those that will have a clear night sky this weekend, Saturday the 29th, we are expected to see the first of three supermoons that are going to be back to back to back. And in the middle of those, we're going to have the super blood moon, which will be the final of the blood moon tetrad. So not only will that be a blood moon, it will be a super blood moon. And you're going to see these super moons for the next three months. The 29th of this month, September 28th, and October 27th. Now this is when the moon can appear 14% larger and sometimes 30% brighter than a regular full moon. When it's at its closest approach. Now, the Native Americans dubbed this one the sturgeon moon because they say it was apparently easier to catch huge sturgeon this time of year under this moonlight. But just so everyone's aware, you have anyone out there that likes to lock onto the moon to see things and what's going on there, this weekend would be a prime time to do so. And like I said, the one after that will be the super blood moon. So I'll leave a link, keep you guys posted with more space information as I come across it. It's been Dabu7. Peace.